All right, I'm going to show you the setup that I'm using for this session. Um, basically, I've got two magnetic coils. These are a Leva Wave coils that are for a PEMF magnetic stimulation system. And they're super nice coils. You can get them on eBay for like $25. And they hook into an audio jack. They have an audio jack connector on the end of them, just your standard 3.5 millimeter audio jack stereo. And so I hook them into the light connector on the My Place Casina. And that sends out sufficient power. So this is the Casina My Machine. And it's an awesome machine. So it's hooked up by USB to the computer and then this is a gauze meter that we'll use to show the magnetic field so I have an audio strobe session that I'll show you and we're going to send audio strobe out to the magnetic coils okay so I'm running that now Coil should be active. Turn on the meter. You can hear it. Yeah, you can already hear the pulsing. So that's pulsing at around 13 hertz. And what I do is I put them on each side of my forehead on each temple and run a current through there. Now you can see the field's directional. So that's basically the field. And it's quite strong. They say it measures at about 80 to 100 milligauss. So this one goes up to 10. Yeah, so I mean, it, it's way in excess of that. So really, this is just showing the pulsing more so than it's sh measuring the strength. We just want to see that it's working. And it indeed is working. Just fine. So that's what I'm using for this session to put on my forehead so that I can stimulate the SMR beta frequencies that I want to use for this session. So next we'll look at the session. All right, now one thing I want to mention is that I'm not advising that you do this on yourself. You, you can if you want. I have a basically libertarian point of view about that that says you can try whatever you want to on yourself, you know. Um, but we have to realize that there's a big movement in uh, these types of researches that's using a system called transcranial magnetic stimulation. And it's much, much stronger than anything coils like this have put up, put out. I mean, a hundred to a thousand times stronger. So there's really no risk or danger to using a magnetic stimulation system like this, uh, short of putting, you know, a frequency in that's too stable. Uh, we have to realize that a seizure is caused by your brain taking on too stable of a frequency. So people that, you know, talk about entrainment or whatever and imagine entrainment as being your brain taking on a single frequency uh, in response to a stimulus, you don't want that. That That's called a seizure. Um, so entrainment's nothing like that in actual practice, and you can look at some of my other videos to see what that's like. But anyway, I just wanted to make a quick, maybe basically caveat that says, hey, this is what I'm doing for myself. This is experiments that I do. I find them to be perfectly safe. Um, however, it's up to you 
to do whatever you'd like, but more so we're interested in gathering some interesting data.